Sometimes with certain business activities complementary or supplementary items are required when a product is ordered. In Microsoft Dynamics AX these are known as a supplementary cells. In this session we will review the basic functionality of supplementary items and product demonstration for the same. For example let us say whenever we sell the road bicycle we offer the ring bell as a complementary product. Let us review what are the supplementary groups. We have a three types of group supplementary customer item groups, supplementary item groups and supplementary vendor item groups. When we want to offer same supplementary product to multiple customers we can create a customer group and link it to the multiple customers and when we want to offer same supplementary product to multiple items then we can create item groups and link it to the multiple products similarly when we receive one or more supplementary product from a multiple vendors then we can create a vendor group and link it to the different vendors so having a group will help us set up the supplementary product more effectively let us review the product demonstration for the same as you can see what we are going to do is we are going to set up a supplementary product for the customer so that whenever we sell the one piece of bicycle a ring bell will be offered as a complementary product to customer in order to set up supplementary product for customer we need to go to sales and marketing then under the setup click on uh, supplementary items first of all we need to create a supplementary customer groups which we can link to the different customers to which we want to offer ring bell as a complementary product so let's create a supplementary customer group click on new and give it a meaningful name so we call it as a ring bell and then we can set up supplementary items for this group click on supplementary items from action menu and supplementary sales item similarly if you want to set up a supplementary product for a vendor create a supplementary vendor group and set up the supplementary items the procedure is similar as we do it for customer click a new supplementary item here we have a option whether we want to offer supplementary product for a group of product or for individual product or for all product in our case only for bicycle we want to offer ring bell as a supplementary product so we will select table then item relation here we can select the product for which we want to offer a supplementary product so it's a road bicycle and here we can select which configuration size and color we want to offer this so we select default configuration C1 so small size and blue color then here it's a quantity limit for how many pieces of bicycle we want to offer a ring bell so in our case it's one for every pieces of bicycle supplementary product will be offered if it is two at least we need to sell two pieces of bicycle to offer a supplementary product this is what it signifies for so in our case we give one because for every pieces of bicycle we sell to customer we will offer a ring bell then here we select the supplementary product which we want to offer then say ring bell how many quantities of supplementary product we want to offer so for each pieces of bicycle we will offer one piece of ring bell so give it one save the record then here we have a multiple quantities uh, for how many pieces of uh, bicycle we want to offer a ring bell there is a slight difference between quantity limit and multiple quantity if quantity limit is 10 then it says that minimum there should be a 10 pieces of bicycle in order to qualify for a supplementary product however multiple quantity says if we say 2 for every 2 pieces of bicycle there should be a supplementary product so if we have quantity 10 if we create a sales line for a 9 pieces ring bell cannot be offered 
it's not eligible for supplementary product however if we make the quantity sales line order quantity as 10 then it is eligible for supplementary product and how many supplementary products will be required that will be determined by the multiple quantities so for every two pieces of bicycle we need to give one ring bell as a supplementary product so give it two or one in our case it is one because for every pieces of bicycle we will offer one supplementary product then here we can make it a valid for a particular time so let's say this is valid for a current week that is 11th may to 15th may now here we have some additional check boxes so free of charge that means the selling price of a ring bell will be zero that is being offered as a free however if this checkbox is not checked then the price of the ring bell will also be invoiced to customer for our case we offer it as a free of charge then it is optional that means system will suggest that okay there is a supplementary product whether you want to offer or not that we determine while selling the product to customer so we make it optional if it is not optional then it will be suggested by default so we currently we don't select as a optional we will review the application later once only that means for every sales order or every purchase order the supplementary product only offered once so if once only is checked it will be only calculated once so we will also review the application of once only but for now we just uh, go ahead with the setup and see it and as a next step we need to link this supplementary customer group to customer and in order to link it under the sales and marketing click on all customers 2013 is the customer which will sell product to and under this sales order default here we have a other information field group and under which we have a supplementary item click on edit and here we can link the ring bell we can link same supplementary customer group to multiple customers who are all eligible for to receive supplementary product then close this and then as a next step we create a sales order for this customer so we create a new sales order for customer 2013 and here first of all we will add a sales line for road bicycle we enter it for five pieces uh, once we enter the sales line we can uh, calculate the supplementary product by clicking on sales order line action menu and then from sales order line action and then click on calculate supplementary items as we can see the system has calculated that five ring bells are required to be offered as a supplementary product if we click on ok then it will create a new sales line here as you can see uh, now as a next step uh, we will review how we can make the supplementary product as an optional so we go to the sales and marketing and uh, customer groups supplementary customer groups select the group which we just created and click on supplementary sales item here we make it optional and then we again come back to sales order and then calculate the supplementary items and as you can see earlier it was not an optional so it was by default selected to be included and uh, here we have a option whether to include it or not so if you want to include the supplementary product then click on include and then click on ok so the all the optional product will be shown in the middle grid uh, which we can now remove and uh, then we will review the application of once only so for that i will create a multiple sales line uh, so ideally uh, since we are selling total 10 pieces of bicycle 10 pieces of ring bell should be qualified as a supplementary product as you can see both of them are shown as an optional product because currently it is made optional and 5 is getting calculated however 
if we make it uh, once only so we will click on once only and now if we calculate we, it will calculate at the sales order level and it will only consider the first sales order line so for the first sales order line the five pieces of ring bell should get qualified supplementary item and as you can see earlier there were two lines with five pieces each but now since it is once only stack it will calculate at the order level and it will only calculate for the first sales line so as we can see five pieces are getting qualified we can say include and we can edit once supplementary product are added as a sales line it can be processed uh, as usual well. 